I don't want to go. I don't want to do this. Alrighty guys, this is the first day of my 312.30, however, however you say it, challenge. <laughs> I am so excited about uh, just kind of this next, how long do you do a week? Yeah. This next <laughs> week of working out. I really want to be like a gym girl, but sometimes just find like consistency hard. So having a challenge like this is actually really good for me. Like if you guys want to join along, we can kind of keep track of it together. I'm going to be posting a whole breakdown at the end of the week <laughs> about my experience. So do it along with me guys. And then on Friday, we'll see kind of how we all feel. You can compare how you feel versus how I feel and see if there's something that we want to continue. Mm -hmm. Anyways, I'm off to the gym. So I'll see you guys later. <laughs> Take over my job. See, that was pretty good. <laughs> I'm literally recording. Oh. <laughs> I got off of that. That's gonna be my intro. Well, good though, huh? yeah, that was great. Anyways, hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I really don't wanna go to the gym right now, but that is part of the challenge. If you guys don't know from the title, I am doing the 12, 3, 30 walking challenge for this week. Basically what you do is you go on the treadmill and you walk for 30 minutes at a speed of three with an incline of 12. So the reason I wanna do this is because I am not a gym girly. I love working out, I love the way I feel after I work out, but I don't really know what to do at the gym. So when I do go to the gym, I usually walk on the treadmill or do one of the classes. There's only a few of the classes that actually fit within my schedule that I can take. So the reason I'm doing this challenge is because it gives me like, I guess something more to do. Um, a lot of the workout equipment, I don't know how to use like the machines and stuff. And I'm not really at the point where I'm ready to figure it out. So I think this is just a good way to walk every day and just get my heart rate up. I personally exercise just because it makes me feel good and I want to be healthy and so that's why we're doing this challenge. I really don't feel like going to the gym today, but let's go ahead and go to the gym together. You guys are gonna hold me accountable, so let's go together. Anyways, I'm just stalling now. Also, if you're new here, my name is Marianne and I create fashion lifestyle content. All right, let's go to the gym. Okay, I am so happy that day one is done. I feel so good. I'm so happy the whole time I was like, when is this gonna be over? But I'm so glad that I did it. I feel really good. I don't know if you guys can tell, my face, my face gets super red. Right now it doesn't look as red, but it definitely gets really, really red after a workout. I wanted to get up, give up several times, but I'm so glad I did that. I really love this challenge because I feel like it's so attainable. Like just walking on the treadmill is such an easy thing to do. For 30 minutes, it's like, okay, I know that this is something I can do. I'm feeling good. Day one is done. Thank you guys for doing this with me. So I will see you guys tomorrow for day two. So I just got off work and I I'm heading to the gym right now. I was listening to a Gilmore Girls podcast and it just ended and I thought another episode was going to start playing. Um, it's called Gilmore to Say. If anybody's interested, it's so good. But I thought another episode was gonna start playing and then Taylor Swift came on. So I am in a great mood. I feel pumped up. I'm ready to walk and I'm ready. I feel like the lighting is so aggressive right now. I am ready to get our gym on. Obviously, I'm in my work clothes right now, so I will change when I get to the gym, and I will see you guys there. I'm done with the day two. I'm so happy, I feel great, and now I am starving, so I'm gonna go home and get some food. I will see you guys tomorrow. I look like an egg, again, right now. Anyways, I have this cutie little French braid in instead of a ponytail, and my arms are shaking. If you know, you know. Today is day three. I was actually really excited today to go walk, 
which I'm pretty happy about. The whole day I was kind of looking forward to going to the gym. It feels kind of like my alone time. I get to watch my shows and just walk and hang out. And I don't know, I was really excited about it today. So yeah, I'm ready to go to the gym. I'm glad that my mind shift has kind of changed from what it used to be because used to I had no desire to go, but now I'm like excited to go. Also, I'm going to insert my set active haul for you guys after today's gym session. I am actually wearing my set active little t-shirt that I got, which I will show you guys at the gym when I do my gym photo. But yeah, I'll see you guys there. I'm so excited. I just got my set active package. I'm so excited. This is the first time that I've ever tried anything from set active and I ordered quite a few things. So I'm going to do a try on and give you guys my review. Okay. So from first impressions, the color looks amazing. Let me turn on the brightness so that you guys can see. I'm sorry that the lighting is so bad. It's really gloomy outside. But anyways, from first impression, the color looks really great. I got a pair of leggings in size medium, mostly because the small was sold out. And then I got a t-shirt, like a little baby crop t-shirt and a sports bra. So let's go ahead and try it on. Okay, so upon first impression, I don't actually know how I feel about these. I will say the leggings are really soft and super nice and high-waisted. The band on the sports bra is super loose, so that's gonna have to be returned. The t-shirt is really comfortable, but the leggings and the t-shirt are a different color. So I don't really know what that's about. Also, another thing I don't like is that the leggings don't have any pockets. My favorite pair of leggings are the ones by Aerie, the offline high-waisted ones by Aerie, and they have pockets on both of the sides. These ones don't have any pockets. I don't know, I just don't think they're like super flattering. So, and then, I don't know. I don't know if it's a vibe. Let me, let me show you guys what it looks like in the mirror with slightly better lighting. <laughs> It's not a vibe. I don't know. I don't know. What do you guys think? It's definitely not super flattering. Like my other leggings snatch me in so good and they look really flattering on the waist. These I feel like aren't doing me any favors. I don't know for as much as I spent for it. It's not a win. Okay. So I do think I'm going to keep this shirt. It's really comfortable. I love the color. I mean, I just am not I'm not vibing with the leggings or the sports bra. I'm just disappointed. Like, I really wanted to love this set. And I don't know, just for how much it costs, I really don't think it's worth it. The size of the leggings fit perfectly. It's just little, like, design things that I don't like. I don't think they're super flattering. They're really soft. I will give them that. And they are high-waisted, but I just don't like them. The color is nice. The sports bra is not great. It's not supportive at all. I like the top, I'll be keeping it, but the leggings and the sports bra, I'm gonna return. For as much money as I paid for this whole set, I really expected to like it more, but that's okay. Trial and error, at least now I know. <laughs> and I'm not gonna write set active off, but I don't know if I will be ordering from them anytime soon. Hey, hi, I am so tired but it is day four it is thursday here's my little fit don't mind the stuff in the background i am so tired today i really don't want to go to the gym but jeremy convinced me to so i'm not gonna break my challenge let's go to the gym i am sweating so much everywhere it's not even funny i think recently this week i've just been doing so many things while this is like good alone time it's also like something that I have to go do. Lately, I've been feeling kind of like stressed and overwhelmed. Hopefully, the weekend will be really good. I don't have anything going on, so I should be able to just like rest and decompress and chill out. Also, I can't wait to shower. I'm so tired right now, but my sister is going to join me today. So let's just do it and get it over with. This week was a lot just like Work-wise, it was a lot. I feel kind of burnt out. I'm just tired, I'm really tired. I haven't been sleeping super well. I mean, I never sleep super well, but I'll show you my outfit, it's nothing crazy. I've been realizing this week that I don't really have a lot of workout clothes. 
so I'm sorry if this wasn't as glamorous as you were expecting it, but here is my workout fit for today. Just a t-shirt tucked into some like green running shorts. Anyways, let's go to the gym. I was kind of nervous for that one because I was so tired when I was going to start. And Julia, my sister, was joining me. So obviously I wasn't going to like watch a show or listen to music because that would just be rude. So we talked the whole time, which was good. It was good to catch up. But we were also like, <sighs> while we were talking, like just breathing so hard. But it was a good workout. It went by faster than I anticipated it to go. It's a gorgeous day outside, you guys. It's so beautiful. It's like 60 degrees and sunny. It feels warm. I'm wearing shorts, living my best life. Yay, I'm happy. Let's go home. I just wanted to show you guys my snack, my uh, post-workout snack. And this is a shameless plug to go watch my video that just posted today. So go watch it. Anyways, see you tomorrow. Okay, so today is Saturday. I'm not gonna go to the gym tomorrow because tomorrow's Sunday and I just wanna chill. Um, so I'm just gonna go again on Monday and that will be my full week. I'm like happy and sad that I'm almost done with this challenge, but let's go walk. Um, so kind of annoying. My gym is closed right now. If you guys don't know, my husband works at the college that we went to, and so we get free access to our gym, which is nice, but that means they're on college hours, and right now it's spring break, and they're closed on the weekends, but open during the week. So that's really annoying. So I'm just gonna come back Monday and Tuesday, I guess. So sorry about that, guys. <laughs> I'll see you on Monday. <laughs> Good morning, it is day seven, it is Tuesday. I'm really excited, this is the last day of our challenge. I cannot believe it. I'm not wearing any makeup today because it just wasn't the vibe, but let's go ahead and go walk. All right guys, well I just wanted to end out the vlog right here and give you my final thoughts about this week's challenge. I actually really enjoyed it. It was a lot of fun. My legs are and were so sore every single day after doing it, especially my calves, which makes sense because you're on an incline. But I had a really fun time. It was a great challenge because it is something that is very attainable but also is hard. <laughs> like it was definitely a challenge for me to do this every day. And most of the time I was just like, okay, when's it gonna be over? It definitely pushes you. I think if you are somebody who is a beginner to the gym, who is new to the gym, or just wants to do something besides their regular gym routine, wants a break, this would be a really good thing to do. This video is inspired by Keegan Acton. If you guys don't know her, she is a YouTuber that I often watch. I love her videos. She did do a video like this last year, and this is actually where I found this 12-3-30 treadmill trend from. I know it was trending on TikTok before she made her video, but I saw it from her video, and I had been doing this sporadically throughout this past year, but I had never done it consistently for multiple days in a row. I will definitely be doing it more often than I used to. At the beginning of this year, I was not ready to go straight back into full on workouts. And so I just started walking on the treadmill. The only rule I set for myself when I was walking was just 30 minutes. I wasn't even trying to get a distance or a speed or anything. And so kind of having this incline and speed and amount of time was really helpful for me and I just love it. I thought it was really fun. I do feel really good. Yeah, I think that's all I have to say. I will link Keegan's video down below. Thank you guys for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give me a big thumbs up and make sure to subscribe. I'm trying to get 500 subscribers by the end of March and I definitely think we can do it, but I need your guys' help. Anyways, I love you guys and I will be seeing you in next week's video. Bye.